Hello again. So I am in the car now on my way to the Royal Albert Hall, which is where the BAFTAs are this year. Um, managed to get some makeup on, which was uh, something. Bit of a disaster with the hair today because my lovely hairdresser who is gonna come around and help me, she couldn't make it. So uh, we're just gonna have to roll with it, this hair today. It's been a bit of a logistical scramble. Mums out there, you'll know what I mean. The juggle is real. My three-year-old had to get to a party. I had to draw my husband off. I had to get over to my mum's house because she is my date for the red carpet. Um, but here we are. I'm wearing this gorgeous dress from Seraphine, which does actually make me feel pretty good and uh, a million dollars despite being 35 weeks pregnant. I'm being so excited about the ceremony this year, I have to say. Can't wait to see what Joanna Lumley does, I love her. And it's so exciting that we've got a woman hosting for the first time in so long. Much as I love Stephen Fry, I just think it's absolutely the right call for this year. Looking forward to seeing what everyone's wearing on the red carpet, of course. I suspect most people, I hope most people will be in black because time is very much up. Loving my black dress, thank you, Seraphine. Um, but I think no one's under any illusion that wearing a black dress is actually gonna change the industry, but it's really, really important to make that statement. I'm really proud as a member of BAFTA Council of what BAFTA's done in terms of playing its own role, drawing up guidelines. I think the announcement of a fighting fund funded by actresses, Emma Watson's just given an incredibly generous donation. All of that is good. And uh, here are my tickets, very exciting. So I will see you on the red carpet. So made it to the red carpet. It's amazing to see so many people wearing such fabulous outfits, mostly black. Time is definitely up, seeing loads of guys as well wearing the Time's Up here, which is very exciting. And it's, uh, it's gonna be a historic occasion, I think. In some ways, too, by the way. it's like, yeah, you too, yeah? We're going uh, into the world's greatest, most glamorous funeral, and I was thinking, uh, that's kind of what this is really. It is the end uh, of a moment, uh, an end of an era where we've been able to get away with this stuff. So time is up. It's going to be a great night.